closing in on a shot at glory. Which one of these two teams will qualify for the decisive match, the World Cup Final? We have all the action live coming up right here on EA TV. How about this for a World Cup semi-final? Brazil and Argentina on a collision course. Brazil the five times winners. Argentina twice the champions. Derek Ray with Stuart Robson. Stuart, we're going to be suitably entertained. Well, when I think about World Cups, I always think about Brazil and Argentina. Yes, you can put Italy and Germany in there as well. But these two nations have been brilliant at World Cups. Remember the 1978 World Cup? played in Argentina, which Argentina won, and then you go back to the 1970 and that brilliant Brazil side. This could be an absolute classic. Really looking forward to this one. And the contest begins. The starting 11 for Brazil. Alisson begins in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. Casemiro plays alongside Lucas Paqueta in central midfield. And the focal point in attack today is Neymar. The Argentina first team. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Lionel Messi starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And leading the line, Lautaro Martinez. A real opening now. Opportunity. And it's there for him. He can't hold on to it. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Well, as an official, you have to be cautious when it comes to an injury situation like this one. Substitution for the hosts. Leading the match, number 22. Lautaro Martinez coming up to the pitch. Number nine, Angel Correa. Well, a drop ball after the injury situation. De Paul. Paredes. Well, Neymar really is one of the greats in the world game. Stuart, interested in your opinion as far as this match? Oh, they're in here, Derek. And freedom for Di Maria. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. Well, just look at the defending here. They've made it so easy for him in the end. That's just not good enough. And so Brazil get the game restarted. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they come up with a quick response? Danilo. Alexandro. Neymar. Nicely timed tackle. Correa. Continues his run. A really top-notch piece of defending. Fred. And well, that's a super ball over the top. A high degree of difficulty with that sort of attempt. Well, he's just mistimed it, hasn't he? 
didn't catch it how he would have wanted and well that's the result Rodrigo de Paul Well, attacking possibilities. Correa, he's got to score! And a goal! How about that? As they increase their advantage, and who's to say they won't be going to the final at this rate? Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. And dribbling with it, but out of play. Danilo. And a good-looking ball. Not to be. And still chasing this game. Well, that was the chance to get back into this. As it is, they're going to struggle now. Correa went in strongly, decisively. Well, Argentina are enjoying most of the possession and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. Yes, who knows? Maybe another opportunity in the works for them. Superbly read and executed. And it was turned out, so a throw-in will be next. Correa. Correa! Well, he didn't miss by an awful lot. Casemiro. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Options in the middle. A goal! And it's very much game on here! Well, here it is again. And what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Well, they get the ball rolling again, with Brazil believing again. Molina. And that was a very fine read. Oh, nice ball. Will he play it in? Neymar ready at the far post. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Correa. Giovanni Lo Celso. Di Maria. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. High pressing at its best. And cleared away, a corner kick it'll be. The delivery from Neymar. Well, no problems defensively. And Neymar! Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Di Maria. Neymar. Well, trying to place it, but without any great success. Well, maybe went for the wrong technique. If he'd have hit it with power, he may have got a better result. That's a poor effort, really.
Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. A foul, but advantage played. Well, danger here as he runs at them. And a goal here! Well, it took a definite nick, and nothing the keeper could do about it whatsoever. Well, as you can see, he gets a bit lucky here. The deflection just had the keeper wrong-footed, but he won't worry about that. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. So back in business, the ball is rolling again. Brazil's difficulties there for all to see in the first half. How do they respond now? And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. High quality defending. Paredes. Giovanni Lo Celso. Di Maria. Well, he's going to be disappointed with that pass. Di Maria. The press was on and it worked. Correa. Di Maria now. Good work from Brazil to win the ball back. And Neymar! Now with Messi. Messi. And now Correa. Chance for Correa! Safe pair of hands, did his job. Danilo. Vinicius Jr. And a header goal it is! Right on cue. Well, we can see it again now, and it all starts with the pass over the top. It takes out so many defenders. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. Can't really say defences are on top. 3 2. So half an hour remaining. De Paul. Giovanni Lo Celso. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. And Neymar. a simple save to make it's Neymar's corner keeper getting the touch and relief as the keeper holds on well he reacts so quickly doesn't he that's a great bit of work from him Really closing him down here. Counter attacking very much an option. Dibala. 
And now Correa. Far from a good pass. Neymar. Firing it towards goal. Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Well, they survived the attack. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. Well, it's always at the discretion of the referee, in this case, opting not to book him. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. And into the last 20 minutes. And he read it well defensively. And a chance to whip it in here. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. And forward this time goes Neymar with options aplenty. And Neymar! Neymar! Well, if truth be told, he made it rather straightforward for the keeper. Well, he knows it. That is a real waste of a great opportunity. Well, great read there to intercept. Neymar. Fred Alexandro now back to Fred Neymar defended well a bit of running room now on the wing Correa timely intervention Neymar, down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity to snatch something. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. And Brazil in a position of menace. And blocked for now. Otamendi, the referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. And Brazil have it back now. But doesn't have to do it on his own. And well, the fans really want him to shoot. Casimiro. And here's Fred. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. The tackle completely missed time, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Well, just look at this. He's so alive to the situation. That's a neat-headed goal in the end. So the current scoreline, 4-2. And full time here. Argentina will be taking part in the 2022 World Cup Final. Well, it was a good game, wasn't it? They dominated most of the play and fully deserved their win to be in the final. But they will need to defend much better than they did today. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.